that the estimated incidence of coronary heart disease in the country is very high. It's about 141 per 100,000 population. So this is one of the highest uh, morbidity level that we ever face. That means every year there are about 40,000 new cases of coronary heart disease. About 60% of these cases is, will be managed by Ministry of Health. 60% of these cases are I mean, managed by Ministry of Health, while the rest will seek treatment at private and non-Ministry of Health cardiac facilities. Presently, we have about 180 cardiologists in the country. 180 cardiologists in the country. And at a norm of one cardiologist of 50,000 population, and actually, we actually need about 560 cardiologists. So that means we are still short of cardiologists in this country. And moreover, the current, the current 180 cardiologists in the country, only 26 are in Ministry of Health. The rest is IGN, some in, oh, most of them in private hospital. This means that less than 15% of cardiologists in the country employ in Ministry of Health and are handling about 60% of the patients in this country. So we have trained more. Uh, cardiologists in this country. As I've said, we need at least we need at least 560 cardiologists in this country. So, in view of the high morbidity and mortality rate uh, from heart disease, the Ministry of Health has developed a fairly comprehensive cardiac program, which is not only readily accessible, but also affordable to Rakyat. So, we will continue to strengthen the program under the Time Leisure Plan which I mentioned in the uh, speech just now, we're going to upgrade uh, Kuala Tenganu, uh, we're going to upgrade uh, Kelantan Hospital, uh, the Ipoh Hospital, uh, Kuantan Hospital, uh, the SMC, uh, Queen Elizabeth Kodukitambalu, the Sultan Amina Hospital. These are all the regional hospitals that we're going to upgrade to uh, provide cardiothoracic and cardiology uh, services to the Ryan.